Ok, já põe ele, chai já tá todo a tona. Todo chai lo. Right, buddy. Anytime you can shoot it. <laughs> no, you shot it right next to it. That's not as bad. That's something else. We'll shoot it again. Shoot up, up a little bit. Okay, you want to try this angle right here, buddy? Here, come and stay at this angle right here. Right here. Right there. Yeah, I know. He's sitting right next to the branch. You have to shoot like... You got it? Take him down. There you go. Okay, it went up a little bit. Went up like three feet up. I mean, take that back. <laughs> like two, two feet up. You see that tip right there? Oh, right there, there it is. Okay. Oh man. I don't know. The uh, squirrel did a kamikaze, right? <laughs> I hope. I hope it didn't run away, dude. Charlie shot it. Uh, the squirrel did a uh, deer devil dive all the way from there to this tree. So it landed on the ground on that tree. So I, I hope the squirrel was down there because uh, he shot that squirrel and it sounds like a body shot. Okay, go ahead. I will stay right here. Okay, it landed right in the center of that big tree right there. So uh, if the squirrel's injured, it should be there. Not over there, Charlie. That tree right there. That tree. <coughs> oh, man. Oh, sorry, man. Sneezing. No, that tree. Keep going. Keep going. Keep going. Keep going right there. Somewhere right there. Turn around to the tree. Yeah, look. Look around that area. You see it? Oh, right there, Charlie. Come here, come here. It's on. It's up on the tree. Come here. Come on. Come to me. Come to me. Okay, it's going up. It's going up on the other side of the tree. Go to the other side of the tree. It's going up. Okay, it's like uh, keep going. Keep going. It's it's on my side now, but it's going up. It's going up. It's on my side now. You come over here. Okay, it's about like a uh, twenty feet up. On my side, okay? On my side, look at my side. It says climb me up, it's climb me up. Right there. Okay, you see it? Okay, it's right there, Charlie. Right there, right there, right there. Oh man, it went on to the other side. Okay, hold on. L let me put the camera down. And I, I hope the camera could capture it. Let me see. Oops, 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 sorry about that, guys. Okay, right there. Okay, go on to the other side. Uh, let's see if I can shoot it too. Yeah, I know. No, no, go over there. Go over there so they... So the squirrel could turn my way. No, go over there, Charlie. Keep going, but not that far. Just go right, right next to the tree. Alright, folks, I hope you can see me. Okay, keep going. You see it? All right. Is it all the way up now? Okay, I'm gonna come pick you guys up now. Okay, Charlie saw it on his side. He's getting ready to shoot. He missed. Charlie missed. 
You know, he's at an incline, you have to shoot like below his waist. Oh, you want to move back further? There he goes. Good job, man. After three shot. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Do we call that good shooting? Yes, it's good shooting. <laughs> At least you hit him or her. Okay, you put your name. Try to do now. The John Long Law, and you didn't hear Kim wrote or John Long Tot in Jay. Long Dong Jay Charlie, do all palm at all. But here, my toe. Now, do not hung dinner. Right? Yeah, you shot it in the stomach. Okay, that's all right, buddy. The important thing is, uh, you know, you you put him out. So, oh yeah, it's a big, big fat male squirrel. It's a boy, guys. <laughs> yeah. With uh, up at his inside was. Yeah. Okay, chào mừng nhé. À, cứ làm nó dễ, tôi lấy tôi nản gì nó, thế chị. Right, folks? Uh, we'll get back with you as soon as we spot another squirrel. Stay tuned now. All right, folks. Uh, as we uh, shot Charlie squirrel down there, then we uh, drive up to this, on this road, we spot some hen of the wood over there by the fence line. So uh, let's go pick them. I hope they still good, Charlie. Hands of the woods. Oh yeah, yep, it is. It's uh, it's that distinct, uh, bright yellow color. So, they're hands of the woods. Oh, look at that, dude! Look at that. Here, let me grab my knife. A word. Okay. Now this. These. Yeah, or hands of the wood, folks. Uh, yeah, yeah, I know. Yeah. So actually, uh, we we get to leave, like. These, we just gotta take these two small ones. Now some of those are yellow and some of those are kind of got Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. I dropped it. Look at that beautiful, beautiful, beautiful. It must be pretty A meaty. Oh yeah, it is. Very moist. Meaty too. It's really young, look like the, the last ones we we found that the, the the mushroom was like broader. Yeah, yeah. A lot bigger. Yep. Know, we leave them? Nah, this is about it right here, because uh, you know the the uh, yeah yeah the like the longer we leave it, it's gonna turn, it's gonna harden. So it right now it is very tender. So so it is good. It is good. We just gotta leave that, and we just gotta take what we want. And uh, yep, all right. It's a good find. We shot a few squirrel, um, and uh, yeah. Ready? Right. Yep. All right. I think like two, two, three years ago, I picked these at the same location too. But it's been this long, it grew back. So, which is a nice find right here. A very nice find. So basically, yeah, yeah, I wanna trim this, these dirt out of the way. All this, 
It's dirt. Yeah, no. it's got a lot of moisture on it. It's it, like I said, from here it looked like it's almost frozen. Yeah. The way it just yep. looks. Yeah, I know. It's not frozen in the summer. <sighs> Man, oh, yeah, we have to. Okay, there it goes. Throw those away. Just get, keep the good piece, the good part. What kind of like broccoli? Oh, yeah, yellow broccoli. Yellow broccoli. There we go. Bag it up. Yeah, we get to bag it up and put it on mice. Bag it up. <coughs> oh boy. <coughs> oh man, always sneeze. All right, folks, uh, we got to go back up this road and uh, see if we could uh, get some fox squirrel. So uh, it is about 10, 30, 11, yeah. Yeah, the, the, uh, the red squirrel is out. He has sunbathed and uh, the gray squirrel are hiding. So I uh, hope we find some uh, gray, but that will be uh, very rare right now. Uh, but maybe we might get lucky, but the majority it will be fox squirrel, okay? All right, stay tuned now. Yeah, there's a squirrel over here, but I don't know if it's still here, though. Yeah, the second tree. Well, 70 yard, right? Um, I can range it real quick here. Oh. Nah, it's okay, man. It's okay, Charlie. 66, somewhere in this area. That's 56, man. Yeah, just stay right here with the camera. I'll go pick it up, okay? I'll go pick it up, buddy. Like Hell yeah. And of course, with the impact. Yeah, we're going to have to talk about some of this. Uh, this guy. I think that's a 25 yeah, cal now. Here yeah. Well. Yeah, I changed mine to a 25 cal. <clears throat> Damn. I'm not used to like I was young, you know what I mean? We could hop this thing like crazy. Yeah. <laughs> okay, it's... Yeah. So I shot it. It was perching right here on that lower branch. It was actually eating a a uh, walnut, so uh, it dropped somewhere below here. Yeah, let me see if I could find. Oh, there it is. Yep, it's a fox squirrel. It's a nice fox squirrel. Ooh, headshot, man. I wouldn't be surprised if I 
spot another one. But uh, yeah, uh, so earlier, uh, Charlie uh, shot a fox squirrel down there by the, the tree. And then uh, I shot this one. Yeah. And then we shot some in the morning. Uh, we shot some uh, gray squirrel. And uh, me and Charlie happens to uh, part away. So nobody's recording us, so we just use the scope cam footage. So uh, basically, uh, I'm, I'm just gonna uh, uh, put on the kill shot footage. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. Yep, and basically it's just kill shot footage. So I'll put that on. And uh, along with this video right here. So uh, from this point on, uh, me and Charlie get a hit back to, uh, to a buddy James' place. Uh, we will be sighting some of our guns in. And hopefully we could get some uh, a squirrel in over there too uh, during the evening. And uh, yeah, but uh, until then, uh, we get to make another round, okay? So hopefully we could get another squirrel in. If not, then uh, we'll see you guys at James. Okay, so you know, I'm going to get to the next one. 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 Um, you almost say in the you saw look Monday or Tuesday, and though you could think you're a good day, pay more pay like this. Child fun, ye in general, Joe. A shy shy, uh, for your uh, uh, for Nando. All right, guys, uh, I'll show you the uh, squirrel that we shot earlier, uh, this morning. Uh, so it'll be on the kill shot footage, but. It's not gonna be a video like this. Okay, so there you go. We shot like uh, we got like one bag, three bags, three bags. Okay, so it's basically uh, the five in the bag. So we have 15, 15 squirrels, and uh, yeah, yeah, we have 15 squirrels. So it's limit uh, 10 squirrel, uh, you know, per person. So, um, so we're yeah, we're five shorts. <laughs> we're five shorts. So let me let me bag this one up. Okay, your point, you know, your nali put out. Go show them that you don't need to talk. Okay, you more go cheat on that. Okay, low stay not a regulation. I am a little book or two. Okay, you know, go to. Yeah, and uh, some of these, the majority of these are, uh, they are gray squirrel. So, uh, yeah, yep. All right, Charlie, let's go do a round. And uh, if not, then let's hit to uh, a James house. Yeah. And uh, get the, get, hopefully get, get the rest of the limit over there. All right, until then, stay tuned. All right, folks, uh, me and Charlie finally got here. 
uh, this is uh, James' uh, family's property. So uh, this is the property that we hunt squirrel on the last video. And uh, when we got here, uh, James uh, surprised us uh, with this uh, kit that he has right here. Okay, uh, this is his uh, Panthera and uh, Show them what you made Yeah, uh, we put a Put a custom bag rider on this one. Yeah, there. Uh, yep Designed it modeled it um, Just put the rail on it yesterday, but FX not sending out the right parts that you need to install it. So I'm waiting on a plug to show up and then I'll be able to to put install the magazine, the, yeah. Install the mag block and then also install a spare magazine holder. Yep. And a yep. bigger bar barricade stop, but this arc of rail on this compact is about as functional as you can get. Yeah, it's nice. It's nice and short too on that uh, compact 22. Yeah, so much more comfortable. Yep. And surprisingly, the 22, it's it's it has a shorter barrel. I think it's a 360, and on the 25 compact, it's a 380 mm -hmm. millimeter uh, a barrel. But anyway, we're, we're, we're not here uh, for the Pantera. We are here for this piece right here. This piece right here. It's the same piece. So this is the, uh, the aftermarket uh, uh, parts that uh, James designed. Okay. So it is 3D printed. And um, he made this one for me. And look at that. Look at that, folks. Got my, my YouTube logo on. <laughs> Ozark Air Guns, huh? And uh, also he made this uh, a barricade stop right here. And it, it is, it is gonna be in the market soon. So uh, right now it is just the prototype and he's gonna finalize everything out. Uh, but uh, it comes in a set, okay? So the set comes with the bag rider and it comes with the uh, barricade stop. And Here's a secret on this very case stuff. Look at that. Look at that. That's where you put your extra magazine. <laughs> How cool is that, huh? Dude, that's cool, man. That's cool. So it's, it's, uh, or, or your primary magazine. Yep. Yeah, there you go. Yep. It could be, yep. It could be your primary or it could be your backup ma uh, magazine. Uh, wishes for me, it will be a backup magazine because I hunt. So, so it, it would be cool to have one in there like that instead of in my uh, backpack. But hey guys, uh, you know, stay tuned. Look for the an upcoming video. Uh, I'm gonna show you guys how to install it, and I will uh, get with you guys on um, on uh, on when will it be available? Okay, through James. And uh, yeah, so yeah, it it is nice. It is a nice addition to this uh, Panthera right there, and. Uh, Yeah, there you go, man. There you go. Because like that. This, yep. block, this block won't fit. Yep, there you go. Nice, nice, nice. All right, guys. Uh, so after this, um, we will be um, going to the woods and to see if we could get some squirrel yeah. in. And like I mentioned it, look for the uh, upcoming video of that bag rider and the uh, a bear cake stop, okay? Um, I will make a separate video of... of uh, how to install it and uh yeah uh so anyway um let us get everything set up and we get a hit to the woods uh to see if we could get some squirrel during the evening until then stay tuned now okay to put you know that's not yet for that charlie uh gao ha jong la uh yon on it you know just shape or more uh uh josh in up or uh the law not see and uh go she could up on on okay uh, this is the uh, FX uh, Pantera, and uh, uh, this is the bag rider that Kutukonyo uh, Jim wanna ya. Okay, Luna Jayo Lu, a barricade stop. That's my whole year new more. Eco a component, a Gomolo Sasa, Chota Hotona, Lu Extra Magazine. Okay, you're the Linton Yan, not your Titoguna, okay. And uh, this is the 500 millimeter Pantera. Okay, folks, uh, me and Charlie, uh, we just uh, got here. Uh, we are uh, uh, sitting here uh, to see if uh, there will be some squirrel uh, coming out uh, to get some acorns, okay? So uh, basically, it's just going to be a sit and wait. And uh, let's see if uh, uh, there will be any squirrel popping out.
uh, right now it is probably about almost 6 p.m. and uh, I'm using my Panthera right here and this is uh, a custom barricade I mean a custom bag rider uh, made by my buddy uh, James and look he even put my logo on it Ozark air guns <laughs> and uh, right here uh, it's a barricade stop so um, yeah I gotta tell you uh, g you know some good news about it and uh, it's actually it also um, uh, has a slot inside to hold one magazine so especially for hunters, uh, it's good to have an extra magazine where we could get it quick instead of putting it in our uh, pockets or in our backpack. And here's Charlie. He's over here and he has his impact. And this is the black impact, the M3, okay? And um, he's shooting 22 also. And I'm shooting 22 uh, slugs. Uh, JSB slugs. Charlie's shooting his homemade slugs, which is, I believe, 24 grain. So, uh, yeah, I'm not going to do a lot of talking now, okay? So, um, whenever we spot a squirrel, if we could do a video on it, we will. If not, then uh, we'll just do a kill shot footage, okay? So, uh, stay tuned. All right, guys, uh, we uh, got back out of the woods. Uh, I shot one. Uh, yeah, well, actually, yeah, I shot at one, missed one, so that's two squirrel. Uh, Charlie shot at one squirrel and missed. So anyway, uh, after that, uh, squirrel was everywhere, but the thing is that they were all the way at the canopy, so we weren't able to, uh, to get a good shot at it. And it, also, it's getting dark. So, yeah, I guess we'll be heading back home. Um, Charlie's uh, putting his rifles away, and after this, I'll put my rifles away. So, okay, now I'm going to put my rifles away. So, 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 I'm going to put all right, folks, uh, I guess we got the total of, let's say, 16 squirrel, okay? Because we got 15 at the farm, so I shot one here. So let's call it 16 squirrel. And uh, yeah, so I uh, appreciate you guys for watching. And I will see you at the next video. Thank you.